You're from EV Outlook. What is that? Uh, basically, it's me, a man in a shed in the garden. There was a German economist called Rudiger Dornbusch, and his mantra was, um, things take longer to change than you thought they would, but then things change faster than you thought they ever could. And this is Roger Atkins, and he knows oh. some serious stuff. I was now, had so I know, Had I known, I would have worn my, uh, my skull shirt and... Um, Oh, suits me. We're at an extraordinary moment in time, both for electric mobility, I believe, and so new energy, renewable energy. The reason I went into Metaverse was to figure out a way uh, to wean the world off of oil. Make no mistake, within this decade, we will see an increasingly rapid shift to electric vehicles. I'm at the future of green tech with Quentin Wilson. We are all facing now a true banquet of consequences. Just charging! Are the OEMs complacent? If we expect the unexpected, what might that be? So, uh, Herr Kleebinder und Herr Atkin. This stuff, you know, <laughs> dare I say it, isn't rocket science. You need a, a flag to follow. I'm here with Elliot Richards. Yeah. <laughs> what we talked about in the last episode. It's a share of space with Arnold Schwarzenegger and Nobel laureate Sam Whittingham. Water the space of five days. Are you going to be able to deliver lithium to these battery factories these guys are all building? But this momentum is at risk of stalling, Roger Atkins says, if the charging process does not become as easy as possible. He is the founder of Electric Vehicles Outlook in the UK. And together, actually, with this lady behind me, we're making a series called Motorsport in the Electric Age. We've been with Mercedes and McLaren and Williams, etc. Well, look at what people are looking at over here. Well, you start with the fundamental, it's the battery. So, it was a. Uh, uh, uh,